to the citizens of the United States, and the United States government. We are anonymous. Last year, on the specific date, November 5th, 2012, Anonymous launched, declared, and engaged Operation V against the United States government. We ask the people to not down, leak or deface government websites or agency affiliate, nor protest or occupy a city, for it did not bring us any legislative change or alternate law, instead it has brought us only bloodshed and false criticism. Citizens of the United States, the idea, known to all as anonymous, has grown tired and has been so for the past seven years. We are not expecting revolution in the next 24 hours, nor are we expecting a call to arms. No, anonymous, as a conclusion, is peaceful resistance. As you've seen with recent events, such as Snowden's exile, NSA's rouge documents, Chelsea Manning's unjust imprisonment, Barrett Brown's ridiculous time sentence, Jeremy Hammond's repulsor trial, PayPal 14's recent police, false wars our government have tried to intervene, and the military torture complex known as Guantanamo Bay, and the Trans-Pacific Partnership Agreement's darkest chapters revealed by WikiLeaks and other free press organizations, and countless lies our president and his men has thrown at our faces. We have all experienced a silent revolution within our conscious, making us fully aware of the happenings behind closed doors, behind the corruption, surveillance, censorship, and propaganda. These events have engulfed fury that has burned our anger to rise and to never stay silent, yet we are either afraid or distracted by miscellaneous events. We are talking to you as people that is sick and tired of its government, its system, messages, projects, and operations. Their promises and goals have brought us downward, not forward. Taking note that this is a message not just to our current president, but to the government as a whole. This transmission, this message, this video, goes directly to the people that are awake, and to those that are not. Therefore, in the year 2015, if, and only if, revolution has not came, Anonymous, will do what is necessary. When we say, Anonymous, we say you, you the people, all of you, stating that you support, Anonymous, or, hate Anonymous, you, are Anonymous, you are a person, you are the idea, just like us, just like all of us, Anonymous is for the people, by, the people. For far too long, we have been thinking too much, and we have felt too little. We see, hear and think of these political agreements, and laws. Yes, it is a priority to be aware of it, yet frankly, we do not feel for the people that are being brutalized, tortured, and killed, for these unjustified laws, events, and talks. To the people of America, you have one year, one year, to show your strength, one year, to show that you want change in your country, to either negotiate or attack the main root of all evil in this globe, to rid of these unjust laws and the men they call themselves our leaders, and to bring justice to the people that have fallen for the system, to inspire other nations to not just create history, but to be history. This is America's time to have its own revolution. You have been operating in the shadows far too long. Taking down a site or watching a video will not bring change. Let us repeat that again. Taking down a site or watching a video will not bring change. It is time to act. Citizens of the United States, Anonymous is not your only hope for a better future or for a better generation. You, the people, hold the key to change not just the so-called land of the free but to inspire future inhabitants that will take the role in the next revolution if there ever needs one. Project V. Engaged. We are anonymous. We are you. We never forgive. We never forget, united as one, divided by none, to the government of the United States, don't expect us. Now, starting today, it is up to you, to make the choice, to either act, or to wait, 
The future for your country rests in your hands, not ours, not the president's, not the government, not the corporations. You decide the vision you want your children, your family, yourself to see, let them expect you.